How y'all doing? It's Rob Bunnum, my character, which went on being a snorp, so we're at your TV on the road. It's time we'll be in Sons of Anarchy Season 3, Episode 7. What happens on this week's episode is the club is trying to get everything ready for them to go to Belfast. Well, a uh, hiccup happens, and the Grand Bastard get a hold of the, the Sons of Anarchy, the, the club. We're trying to find out one of the Grand Bastard's lieutenants or vice president, or I can't remember which one, but... He got killed, and he got murdered by the Calaveras, and the Sons of Anarchy and some of the Grim Bastards go to this meetup the mines are having with the Calaveras, they're having this big uh, picnic, uh, cookout or whatever, and Jackson had talked to the president of the mines, and they tell them to go use the restroom, and they leave the president of the Calaveras on there, and they put, uh, Clay puts a gun to his head and the president of the mine put a gun to his head saying you either tell us who killed uh, a member of the Grand Bastards or we kill you and he tells who did it and they shoot him the person who did it and take it, the president of the Calaveras is cut off and cuts president patch off and gives it, gives it to the vice president tells the vice president to make better decisions than the former president well after this the ex-president of the Calaveras follows Jax home and sees Tara leaving and they're going to try, him and his girlfriend are going to try to do something to Tara so we'll see what happens with that. What else is happening is Gemma gets Tara to help her escape from the hospital and he, she meets with Jax and them and Jax doesn't know what's going on so he gets a phone call from Tara and he didn't want to answer it because him and Tara kind of broke it off in this episode, after what happened in last week's episode, I'm not going to get into that because it's a family friendly uh, channel. But anyway, what happens is, is she gets out and then Unser comes and puts holds a gun on them and tells them they can't go nowhere. And Gemma says, "What are you going to do? Shoot me?" And then her Clay, Jax, and Tig run off, and then Tig gets into the tow truck and tells them to get into the carriage car and head for the airstrip that way Tig can run the uh, cops make the cops chase after him that way they others can get away and they get away and get on the airplane to Belfast and they call the president to Belfast and tell it, him to not let Jimmy know that they're coming because it could be dangerous to them after the president at Belfast gets off the phone with Clay He's talking to Jimmy and telling him that the club is coming. And we'll see what happens with that. And what we find out is, is the Ashby woman from Belfast got with John Taylor, had her daughter. So her daughter is Jack, Te Jack Taylor's half-sister. So we'll see what happens with that. Other than that, that's all that really happened. My question for y'all is, now that the club is on their way to Ireland, what's going to happen with that? As always, preaching on our side, not that Jesus. Y'all should just come out and see what you're thinking about. See you next time.